Asia is a continent rich not only in culture and traditions, but also in mysterious history. Get ready to discover unexplored corners of history, excavations that change our view of the past. Distant cities, mysterious relics, and ancient civilizations are waiting for you. Be sure to watch this video to the end. Hi friend, you're on the Kurtop channel. Ajanta Caves, India in the mysterious depth of western India, on the steep slopes of the gorge, hides one of the greatest wonders of ancient art, the Ajanta Caves. These 30 rock-cut caves have served as a place of worship for Buddhists for centuries. The walls and ceilings of the caves are decorated with exquisite religious paintings that illustrate the life of the Buddha and various Buddhist legends. The oldest of these caves are believed to date back to the 2nd century BC. The bright and detailed drawings are magnificent in their own way and testify to the high level of skill of ancient artists. Ajanta Caves are not just a monument of ancient art, but also a bridge between the past and the present, allowing us to look into the soul of ancient India. Terracotta Army, China In the heart of China, at the foot of Mount Lishan, there is a stunning panoramic view of one of the greatest archaeological discoveries of the 20th century, the Terracotta Army. Created over 2,000 years ago to protect the tomb of China's first emperor, Chen Shi Huan, this army is a colossal collection of more than 8,000 warrior statues, 130 chariots with 520 horses, and 150 cavalry horses. Each warrior is unique. His facial features, clothes, shoes, everything is made with amazing detail. When archaeologists discovered it, the complex in 1974, they were amazed by the scale and excellence of the war. Work. Incredibly, all the figures were originally painted in bright colors, but many have faded over time. The Terracotta Army serves as evidence of the greatness of the Qin Empire and its desire for immortality. It is a living reminder of the power, talent, and ambition of ancient Chinese civilizations. Today, these statues represent not only historical heritage, but also a symbol of China's cultural wealth. Taxila, Pakistan Taxila, an ancient city located in present-day Pakistan, is one of the greatest archaeological sites in South Asia. This city was an important cultural, religious, and commercial center of antiquity, which flourished in the period from the 6th century BC until the 5th century AD. Taxila is known for its universities, which were considered among the first educational institutions in the world. Students from all over Asia came here to study various sciences, including medicine, mathematics, and astronomy. This place also played a key role in the spread of Buddhism throughout the continent. Archaeological excavations in Taxila have unearthed many temples, monasteries, stupas, and other religious buildings. Each of these buildings tells a unique story about the lives and beliefs of the people who lived here many centuries ago. Taxila was also an important part of the Silk Road, the highway linking east and west. This has resulted in a mixture of cultures and traditions, which makes this city exceptionally interesting to explore. Today, Taxila is a UNESCO World Heritage Site and continues to inspire scientists, explorers, and travelers from all over the world with its rich heritage and deep history. Angkor City, Cambodia Angkor, once the capital of the mighty Khmer Empire, is now the symbol of Cambodia and one of the most magnificent archaeological sites in the world. Spread over an area of more than 400 square kilometers, this place was once the center of the political, religious, and cultural life of the region. The central part of Angkor is Angkor Wat, a majestic temple built in honor of the god Vishnu. With its tall towers, intricate reliefs, and impressive galleries, Angkor Wat is an architectural marvel that attracts millions of tourists every year. However, Angkor is not only Angkor Wat. Numerous temples such as Bayan, with its giant stone faces and Ta Prom, which is intertwined with trees, create an atmosphere of mystery and grandeur. This city tells us about the complexity and diversity of Khmer culture. Religious motifs uniting Hinduism and Buddhism are reflected in art objects, statues, and reliefs. Angkor also testifies to the high level of architectural and engineering achievements of the Khmers. Water supply systems, roads, and hydraulic structures speak of a complex urban structure. Today, Angkor is a UNESCO World Heritage Site and a key site for learning about the history and culture of Southeast Asia. 
this ancient city continues to inspire, surprise, and teach us the lessons of the past. Lakshmana Temple, India among the ancient monuments of India, the Lakshmana Temple, a majestic sanctuary built in the 10th century in the city of Kajaraho, occupies a special place. This temple, dedicated to the god Vishnu, serves as a prime example of North Indian temple architecture. The appearance of the temple is striking in its elegance and detail. The stucco work on the facade depicts various episodes from Hindu mythology and also represents the life of the people of that era. Particular attention is drawn to erotic sculptures, which are considered a symbol of spiritual unity and love. The courtyard of the temple is decorated with columns carved from stone, each of which is unique in its design. The temple sanctuary houses a statue of Vishnu, showcasing his various avatars. The Lakshmana temple is not just an architectural marvel, but also an important testimony to the religious, cultural and social life of ancient India. Returning to this place, we plunge into the mysterious world of the past, full of deep philosophical and cultural knowledge. Sigiriya Fortress, Sri Lanka In the heart of Sri Lanka, on top of a massive stone plateau, rises the ancient fortress of Sigiriya. This place, surrounded by legends, is one of the most striking architectural and cultural sites of the island. It is believed that Sigiriya was built in the 5th century AD by King Kasyapa as a royal residence. The ascent to the top is accompanied by passing through the majestic lion's paws, a symbol of power and authority. On the walls of the mountain, amazing frescoes depicting the girls of the clouds, mysterious beauties whose history is still controversial among scientists, have been preserved. Also at the top are gardens and pools, demonstrating the level of engineering of the ancient builders. Sigiriya is not only historical heritage, but also a place of meditation and inspiration. The view from the top of the Sri Lankan jungle is an unforgettable sight, reminiscent of the power of nature and human culture. Petroglyphs of Tamgali, Kazakhstan in the boundless expanses of Central Asia, on the territory of modern Kazakhstan, there is a unique archaeological site, the Petroglyphs of Tamgali. These ancient images carved into the rocks serve as evidence of the cultural and spiritual heritage of the people who have inhabited this region for thousands of years. Tamgali is a real open-air gallery with more than 4,000 engravings. The images date from various eras, from the Bronze Age to the Middle Ages. Here you can see hunting scenes, dances, rituals, and many other passages from the life of ancient people. Particular attention is drawn to the images of solar disks, which, according to scientists, testify to the cult of the sun among the ancient inhabitants of this region. Such drawings indicate the spiritual and cosmic perception of the world among the ancient Kazakhs. Petroglyphs of Tamgali are not just stone drawings. These are pages of history that tell us about the world in which our ancestors lived. In 2004, the complex was included in the UNESCO World Heritage List, confirming its global importance. Looking at these ancient engravings, you can feel the connection of times, immerse yourself in the world of ancient legends and myth, and understand how important it is to preserve and appreciate the cultural heritage of mankind. Temples of Bagan, Myanmar Bagan is an ancient city that has served as a religious and cultural center of Myanmar for centuries. Spread over an area of about 42 square kilometers, it proudly rises above the plain strewn with thousands of pagodas and temples that testify to the former greatness and religious enthusiasm of the ancient kingdoms. The construction of temples in Bagan began in the 9th century and continued until the 13th century. Here you can see architectural masterpieces that reflect a variety of styles and eras, from massive pagodas with golden domes to elegant temples with fine carvings. One of the main features of Bagan is its walls, decorated with ancient paintings and frescoes. These images tell stories from the life of Buddha, scenes from ancient legends, and tell about the life and culture of that era. A visit to Bagan is an immersion to an, in an ancient world full of mysticism, faith and beauty, where every stone and temple contains stories that are waiting for their storyteller. Mohenjo-Dara Complex, Pakistan 
Mohenjo Daro, whose name translates as Hill of the Dead, is one of the greatest archaeological discoveries of the 20th century. It is an ancient city of Hindu civilization, forgotten and buried under layers of time, only to be discovered again in the 1920s. Located in the southern part of Pakistan, Mohenjo Daro is evidence of a highly developed urban culture dating back to 2600 1900 BC. Surprisingly, the city had a complex sewer system, neatly paved streets, and public pools that were used for ritual bathing. The Great Health Resort deserves special attention which, according to scientists, could serve as a venue for religious ceremonies. In addition, archaeologists have discovered a large number of clay figurines depicting people and animals as well as jewelry and even dice. However, despite all its discoveries, many aspects of this ancient civilization remain a mystery. What was the reason for its fall? What was the daily life of its inhabitants like? All this makes Mahendradara incredibly attractive for studying and searching searching for answers. Bactrian Gold, Afghanistan in the heart of Afghanistan, at the crossroads of ancient civilizations, one of the most impressive archaeological treasures of the 20th century has been discovered – Bactrian gold. This amazing find, consisting of more than 20,000 gold objects, was discovered in 1978 by archaeologist Victor Sarianidi. These treasures date back to the first millennium BC and belong to an ancient people who lived in the region of Tilia Tipe in northern Afghanistan. Jewelry, coins, figurines, and many other pieces of art reflect the fusion of different cultures from Greece and Rome to China and India. Jewelry attracts special attention – tiaras, earrings, necklaces – everything is exquisitely decorated with precious stones and inlaid with the finest gold wire. Among the images on the jewelry you can see panthers, deer, dragons, and many other mythical creatures. Interestingly, after its discovery, the treasures were considered lost for a long time due to political instability in the region, but in 2003 they were found in the safe of the Afghan Central Bank. Today, this treasure serves as a reminder of the rich and multifaceted history of Afghanistan and its place in world civilization. Nawan Caves, China in the depth of the Gobi Desert, where the Silk Road stretches across the boundless sands, lies one of China's greatest cultural treasures, the Danhuan Caves. This complex of over 490 caves is home to thousands of Buddha statues and amazing murals covering topics from religion to everyday life. Created by monks since the 4th century AD, these caves became the center of Buddhist art for a millennium. Here you can see the influence of various dynasties and cultures. Indian, Tibetan, Yuga motifs merge with Chinese traditions. Of particular note is the library of the cave, where thousands of manuscripts have been found, including the oldest known examples of a printed book. These texts are not only religious in nature, but also historical, scientific, and literary works. Dan Huan Caves is not just an archaeological site, it is evidence of the spiritual and cultural heritage of China and the entire Silk Road. They tell about the meeting of East and West, about the dialogue of cultures and religions in the heart of Asia. Borobudur Temple, Indonesia Amidst the green jungles of central Java, the majestic Borobudur Temple, the largest Buddhist monument in the world, rises. This unique religious complex was built in the 8th 9th centuries and is the most important symbol of the cultural heritage of Indonesia. This temple is a monumental steppe pyramid crowned with large domes. On its terraces are more than 500 statues of the Buddha and countless reliefs telling stories from the Jataka, stories about the past lives of the Buddha. Following the path in a spiral around the temple, pilgrims pass three levels of Buddhism's cosmology, from the world of desires to the world of absolute enlightenment. The upper platform of the temple is decorated with 72 mystical stupas, each of which contains a statue of Buddha. Forgotten and buried under a layer of earth and volcanic ash, Borobudur was rediscovered only in the 19th century. Today, it is a popular tourist destination, attracting travelers from all over the world with its mystery, beauty, and spiritual depth. This temple is a living reminder of the greatness of Java's ancient Buddhist culture. The amazing and mysterious places of Asia that I talked about in this video are just the tip of the iceberg of the history and cultural heritage of this amazing continent. If you liked what I told and want to know more, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Your likes and comments below the video will help me understand which topics interest you the most. Thanks for your views. Bye, everyone!